Hello there, right, welcome to GCSE Maths with Morale. We're going to look at a series of videos that focus on some rather challenging GCSE Maths questions that have come up in the past um, papers, previous papers, right? So let's start with this one. It says expand and simplify root 3 plus root 15 in bracket and the whole bracket's been squared. Give your answer in the form of n plus m root 5 where n and m are integers, which means we don't want to deal with decimals or fractions of, a stool, of any sort, right? So first things first, we're not going to focus too much on this format just yet. To begin with, we're not going to focus on it. We're going to start by looking at what the question says. We're going to expand. This is, the whole bracket is being squared. So that means we're looking at double bracket, right? Root 3 plus root 15 is being multiplied by root 3 plus root 15, right? We're going to expand the black brackets. We're going to multiply everything in the first bracket with everything in the second bracket. So root 3 times root 3 gives us 3. When you multiply two square roots with the same number, you're basically cancelling out the square root. So root 3 times root 3 is 3. Root 3 times 15 is going to be root 3 root 15. Root 15 times root 3, so I'm going to add and it's going to equal to root 3 root 15 once again. Root 15 times root 15 is going to give us 15. Get rid of the square root, and we got 15, right? Now, to simplify this, we've done the expansion part, now we need to simplify. So in order to simplify, we look at these two. So the numbers we can add together, 3 plus 15 is equal to 18. That's nicely simplified, so common terms. Then we have the thirds, or the square roots to deal with. So we need to simplify root 3 root 15. Now, there's no sign between them, that means they're being multiplied together, which we already know. So root 3 times root 15 is equal to root 45. Now we're going to see, can I simplify it in a way that I can basically make the term easier to understand? So um, root 3, root 15, I cannot get rid of the square root, so I cannot simplify it in that sense. But when I, when I look at root 45, root 45 is also equi equivalent to root 9, root 5. The square root of 9 is equal to 3. So that becomes 3 root 5. That's going to be equal to 3 root 5 plus 3 root 5. And when we simplify that, if I just scroll down a little bit, we have root 3 root 5 plus 3 root 5 is equal to 6 root 5. So we have 18 plus 6 root 5, and that is the most simplified answer. Now, I've done the expansion part, and I've done the simplifying part of the question. So let's look back at the format that they wanted us to put it in. So it's n plus m root 5. We have root 5 there. Perfect. We have 18 as our n and 6 as our five. Hope that makes sense. Let me know if you have any questions.